was a council meeting and they were discussing this environmentally sensitive property. So, you know, I got up and I, I was nice to him. I asked the mayor, I said, you know, when are we going to discuss this next? And he told me to read the back of the newspaper and keep my eyes open. Well, I said, well, can I just call your office and ask you? Can I have an open dialogue? And it was like, for some reason, he did not want to have an open dialogue. It was all secret. And I said, you know what? There's something wrong with this whole deal. The big problem with the insurance, we had a superintendent was actually getting kickbacks from the insurance broker. So I called up the Citizens Campaign. What, what do you got for me? They had actually an insurance reform policy. I was able to come up to the office worked with them for a few short hours, brought it back to my, my group in Toms River, reached out to the business administrator in Toms River. Then the next uh, Board of Ed meeting, they had public comment. We introduced it, just a few short minutes, and we were off and rolling. They were willing to work with us. Right now, the savings is $1.2 million on the broker's fees alone. Plus, we also got a bonus with some of the policy. Those well, it is a toolbox so that an ordinary citizen can participate in the government format. That's what it is. It allows anybody to participate because you can go right to the toolbox, get the right answers, get the right, the right papers, the right directions, the right information. That's what's incredible about it there. So you, you're not wasting your time and you're going about it in the right form. That's what's fantastic about the Citizens Campaign. You could do it without running for office. You could do it. I'm a busy guy. Run the store, take care of my son, plus teach yoga, do sailing. So you know what? You can fit it in. You just make it work. You can definitely make it work. Because you got the toolbox of the citizens' campaign. It's incredible.